Right guys, hope you're all well. Back with another brick lane video and in today's one, we're gonna do a simple video. I'm just gonna build a brick pier and I'm gonna finish it with one of these. Which you might have seen before. It's a finger pointer, finger jointer, whatever you wanna call it. Tuck pointer. Yeah, we're gonna finish it with one of them and see how, how good it looks. Just purchased a new level, 600 mil. See, I don't get them for free, I have to buy these, you see. Because I'm not sponsored yet. Wink, wink. <laughs> solid, that, isn't it? Look at that, it's a beaut. And that's going to help me out on today's video. So this as well, I'm using this 10 inch ox trowel today. Let's see how we get on. I forgot to mention, we're going to do a two brick by two brick pier. And then I'll just finish it off with whatever I can find in the garden. Excuse the garden, by the way. It's an ongoing project. Got our training motor in our barra. Little base sorted out. So we're just going to do two brick. My two brick. I'm going to use my engineering's favourites. And then we'll try and top it off at the end. Something like. I just want to show you guys that you can get a misshaped brick, you see, it's like a wedge shape that, so that could throw your eye really sometimes, but you just have to try and work past it. You can just see there's a gap there, and it's tight with the level there. Right guys, so we've got a few courses on and I've just pointed up a little bit just to see how it's looking. It's looking okay and the mortar's drying all right as well, so not too wet. So I'll continue building it now and we'll see how many courses we can get it up. Actually, it appears are very difficult to build. <laughs> because you're always up against things, you see. The shapes of these bricks on the end, bit, you can see that, can't you? It's a little bit wonky. And it just shows up, you see. See, it's wonky. Now on the return, it's fine, you see. It's, it's, in, it's in line with that brick there. Ranged in. That looks there. It's ranged in with that. It's not like it's kicking out. But then, on the return, it just has that little edge there. You can throw it out, you see. Look like on the lip there. See? Looks like it's lipped out, really, and it's not. So you have to watch things like that. You have to watch things like that, you see, because when you're plumbing up, you might think <laughs> you, you brick works out, but it's not, it's actually some of the bricks.
Alright guys, it's only six course side, we've got it finished uh, and the next step is we're going to top it off with something interesting. What can it be? Here she is, look at that baby, beautiful. 33 pound plus fat. Oh yes, and to be fair they are really good levels, Ox. So I'm just going to top it off with this York stone I've got I found in the garden. I've just cut it square 470. Our pillars, uh, sorry, our pier is 440 wide, so it should leave us a nice overhang. And let's see how it looks. Yeah, Mustn't forget to finish underneath. See loads of people not doing this. Thought tech. Bog basic, bog standard, but that's something you can attempt yourselves and just top it off like that. You could have it as a seat, couldn't you? Hang on, let's sit on it. Well, there we have it, guys. That's our little chimney pot, our little one and a half brick pier. I was going to top it off with some interesting design, but to tell you the truth, I've got to make another video after this, so I'm going to save all my time for that one really so that's about it I mean you might come across something like that if you want to build a seat or something like that <laughs> or looks like a chimney just topped off that's really a rough way of finishing it but just testing it at my new level and it's, it's really good actually I'm impressed with it right guys thanks very much for watching hope you enjoyed it if you did please leave a like rating don't forget to subscribe if you're new I'll catch you in the next one right guys cheers yes, it is. I must be